Hello everyone, this is Red Robot, and the terrible tactic of the day is the Bird Scout. Uh, this is a loadout using the Soda Popper, the Winger, and the Atomizer, all of Scout's really jump focused weapons to uh, create a crazy high flying uh, playstyle. Now, the Soda Popper is one of those weapons that I used to use a lot. I remember when it first got its change to uh, have the uh, additional jumps instead of the increased damage. Um, I really, really loved it. I used to use it with the Criticola, and if you got the hype meter, fighting a like a class with only projectile weapons, like a soldier with the gunboats, or a demo man with no melee weapon, man, you could just hover in the air and destroy them. Uh, the Soda Popper, using it with the Winger and the Atomizer is not the most effective way of using it, but if we're going for the terrible tactic of the Bird Scout, we've got to be in the air as much as possible. Now the strongest thing about this loadout, I'd say, is uh, aside from fighting projectile classes, which find it pretty much impossible to deal with you, is obviously using that height advantage. Now, the Soda Popper is much more effective at escapes than attacking people. Um, you've got plenty of maneuverability, you've got more maneuverability than you'll pretty much ever need. You've got the agility that Scud's always dreamed of, reaching those high places that he could never double jump to before. But at the same time, you don't have that same sort of consistent damage of the Scattergun, or a reliable secondary to back you up. The Winger barely has any rounds, so you're going to be reloading it a lot. So it's usually just worth reloading another soda popper. So it's like you almost don't have a secondary most of the time unless you're using it for jumping. So yeah, this loadout's great fun if you want to be a really, really annoying scout to play against. Um, it's especially good on maps with tons of height variation. Think things like upward. The stage on Badwood is really nice because you can jump all the way from the ground up to the uh, up to the roof and back again. So you can get out of pretty much any situation and completely just frustrate your enemies. Especially fun using it to jump off um, jump off cliffs and then activate your jump to come back up and surprise your enemies because they'll think you're going to die. Like if they taunt or something after air blasting you off, oh man, it's so satisfying killing players to do that. But you've got to be careful. Um, you might think that jumping away is always useful. I mean, it's a great way of escaping, but you might just end up jumping into more danger than you'd anticipated. I find quite often that I jump into unexpected places and get myself killed just because I don't have the firepower to take out the person that's fighting me, and they can just pretty much shoot the ground in front of them and get me killed. Well, that's all I got for you right now, and I'll catch you guys next time.